Donald Trump gets warned by Judge Chutkin to keep his mouth shut. Of course, he fucking doesn't do it, but nothing seems to happen to him. Then Jack Smith comes out with what appears to be kind of a narrow gag order, putting it to Donald Trump and putting it on the fucking table. So now this motion is presented to Judge Chutkin. Now she's going to be forced to have to do something. But what, in fact, does she do? She could sanction him, uh, charge him some money, but we know that doesn't work. She's going to have to come up with some way to impress upon Donald Trump that he needs to shut his fucking cake hole. <laughs> but, but, but here's the thing that bothers me more than anything. There are two phrases in this country. No one is above the law, and all men are created equal. Well, that doesn't seem to be the case, because we know if we were doing what Donald Trump was doing, we'd be put in jail. But because he's former president, that makes it a little hairy. We don't know. we got to be careful. And then, of course, we've got all these people getting away with things that would put them above the law. I think one of the things that we've got to change is to make those sentences true for everybody, regardless of what position you have, regardless of how much money you have. Until you make that change, those two sentences are just not true. We've seen what happens when we get a criminal president in the Oval Office. He walks all over those special freedoms that he gets because of his position. So that tells us we can't do that anymore. There'll be some other crazy, stupid, criminal fuck like Donald Trump some point down the line that will do the same thing. And this country can't afford to go through what we've just gone through. If we fix anything after 2024 and the Democrats get power, we need to look at this. The idea of not indicting a sitting president. It sounds good on paper, but the fact of the matter is if people do crazy criminal shit, we need to stop it. And the only way to stop it is to indict the motherfuckers. And as far as prosecution or the way they're handled prior to a trial like Donald Trump, his position or his notoriety shouldn't make any fucking difference. This stuff needs to change. So I'm going to be interested to see what Judge Chutkin says, what she's going to do, what her options are. But clearly, Donald Trump hasn't learned a lesson. He needs to be shut up and shut down. So I'm anxious to see what she does.